In this video, we're gonna be installing this mirror right here. We're gonna be installing it to the sun visor. We're just gonna be installing it right here. And this is so it can help you whenever you're backing up on a blind side. If you're backing up into a dock and you can no longer see with the regular mirror, then this one becomes really useful. So we're gonna be using double tape. We're just gonna put some double tape in the back of the mirror. This is the M3 double tape. Uh, it, it won't fall off the, the sun visor. I use this setup in different trucks and I never had a problem with it falling or anything. So we're just gonna peel the back layer off. So we put three lines of double tape. So we're just gonna go ahead and mount it. This is the passenger side. Just make sure you don't put it up too high so that it'll, it'll be able to close. So there it goes, this is how it looks. Even though the mirror is a little bigger than the sun visor, probably later on I'm gonna get a custom made mirror for this sun visor, the proper size. But for now I'm just gonna be using this one. So let me show you how it works on the trailer. So this is the way the mirror looks installed. We're gonna go forward and you, we're gonna try to get a, in, a, in a blind spot so you can see the way it looks. As you can see, you have two different views with the mirror on the sun visor and the one on the on the other side, the regular one. So as you can see, we adjusted that one, but sometimes it's, it's not enough when you're doing the blind side. And this, this is when, when the one on the sun visor comes in handy. So that's it for this video, um, even though I really couldn't demonstrate how it really works, but once you have it installed and you're backing into a dock on the blind side, this is going to help you a lot. I know some people try to use the window on the back side of the, of the bunk bit, they try to use this window right here, but uh, I, I'd rather use this one, it, it makes it easier. So thanks for watching.